Welcome to the Empire Business Rampaign, and welcome back to my uh, Principality of Serbia campaign for the Stainless Steel Historical Improvement Project for Medieval 2. We're going to continue with the stuff from last time. This is the second time I've had to record this, because the video didn't record, but the audio did. Uh, so we have to do this again. Uh, we're now, for today, what we're going to be primarily trying to focus on is I'm going to be trying to, now that we have this nice border defensive line against the Holy Roman Empire, uh, we're basically going to be starting to try and push on in and keep pushing into the forces of the Byzantines. As right now, uh, we have been able to do a good amount of damage with them. I've taken Constantinople. There is a name suggestion that I need to rename uh, Constantinople to. Actually, um, it's supposed to be like um, City of the Prince, I think it was, is what the name is supposed to be. So let me go grab that first. Yeah, because Chins of Grab, uh, I actually really like the name of, and I think it sounds really nice. So uh, it's, it's more fitting for us to control this. So what we're going to be doing right now is I do need to try and have so we can still get some more troops around here to watch over the city eventually. Um, I do have extra generals around here, so let me try and move you over this way. I mean, if you go over here, and then that should allow me to hopefully move these guys up. And if that's going to, I can now move you guys if they're happy. Let's see, so... Oh yeah, they are. Oh yeah, you're good. Yeah, you don't need my help out around there. I'm then going to start trying to siege you guys, and basically what we want to do is we're still trying to focus on consolidating the land around us. And so we're not going to be very aggressive, and we're trying to have it so that right now we're like, hey, we're going to keep pushing into here. I'm going to keep trying to see if I can get a ceasefire with the Holy Roman Empire and or with the uh, Byzantine Empire, if they're ever going to. If not, hey, I, I can just keep conquering them. Because um, right now, yes. so if you go scout out around down here, because I know they've got a city somewhere around here, and I think over here too. Looks like they've got that. Looks like they don't have anything over here. They might still have Sinop. Um, and then you try and go down this way. Because I could have sworn there's a city around here. There's something around there. So you'll keep trying to do that. And then I know for sure I'm going to want to try and go up here. And I want to keep trying to have it so that you guys can keep getting some more troops around here. So let me grab uh, you and you to make sure that we have a good defense around here. I will want to try and bring somebody around here to take over the garrison of this city and not have it be my king. Because I want to have him be able to go down to Constantinople. Because of, or, uh, Ken is what I mean. Because uh, if I have him go there, and I do have it, so I can have him be crowned. I just need to have 20,000 gold, and he is fit for the crown. Wherever that trait went. Yeah, fit for the crown. So he is fit for the crown. So we're going to try and have it so that he can go try and do that. Uh, over here that just yet i want to but we'll at least get this small chapel for right now all righty let's see we got a beauty in anatolia um new mission obtain trade agreement um i'm not opposed to doing that technically i do have a diplomat nearby so i can send you on over try and talk to them because that'll at least give me some money missing funds satisfaction and then enemy besieging okay so yeah. they're just being sieged there um and then Hello. Yep. That's the army I think is going to be coming in to try and attack us here. So let me grab one more of you and you. And then I think that'll be good for you guys. Um, and then finish up this. Get the better farms. Get the better farms. And then you. I want to get the joust in this because we're going to keep trying to get even more public order. These guys are barely at 70. So try and do that. Although I should make sure. Um, I feel led by a captain right now. There's no family members around here. Who's I'm, I'm actually going to ignore that one heretic. But I do think I want to try and get my assassins over here. I'm going to keep trying to, well, get a little bit just closer to the west. Because I want to try and stab people. At least try and train on this guy and at least reduce their number a little bit. And then I think I might have enough money to get you. Oh, if anything, um, you, yeah, you're administratively minded. Let's try and bring you over this way. I'm going to have you be the one who's going to try and eventually lead the city of Albarecchia. So try and make your way over here. You'll be the one who's going to watch over that territory. And then... Uh, you guys have broken your alliances there. You guys have declared truce. Um, interesting. Plans? Okay, okay. I'm not opposed to that. Okay. But yeah, no, so for the most part right now, we'll just continue sieging over here. Um, I do think at some point I'm going to want to try and have it so we're going to grab some, like, guys around here to be able to try and get rid of these rebels. Um, just so we can try and somewhat keep using up my money um, that uh, around these areas so that we just don't have, like, how much devastation are these guys causing? Uh, yeah, 800. Yeah, we're definitely going to want to get rid of them at some point. Okay, so you're attacking me here. It's one unit. If I do this just right, we can win this fight. 
I'm just hoping we don't lose this guy. Because I'm trying I'm now sieged Alberegio. This army's gonna keep making their way oh this guy's gonna keep making his way over to the east. And I just need to defend the city at least once. Then I can get my king out of there. I'll start sending him over to Const uh, Con oh my god. Shenzograd uh, after that. But yeah, I'll start deployment. And then I'm gonna have it so they're attacking me. Let's see. I wanna make them follow us and see if I can get to an area. Um not as much hills as I'd like. But if we go around this way, that'll make it so that I'm kind of then ab above ground. I uh, have high ground against them. So if we go here... I'm not going to be able to... Oh, they're turning their backs. Oh, beautiful. Hello, guys. Let's see. So one good charge which should be, a, to be able to do a lot of damage. That did half of their unit. Awesome. They keep trying to charge through them. Because they pretty much have, like, nobody left around that side. And then let's just do it again. So get you guys... Again, want to make sure that we're up... A high, we have the high ground. We're uphill of them. And then let's kind of back up a bit more so we have more space. To get a good charge. So right about there. Turn back around. And charge once more. We lost half their army in that one charge. Down to 37. Get pull back. Let's do it one more time. Losing a couple guys every time, but for the most part, I think we're okay. Let's see, because they're now down to 29. If I outnumber them, I win. Let's get one more good charge. Down to 23. Not enough. Go back. Down to 18. I have 17. Okay, keeping a little bit more distance. Go, go, go. Turn around. And then one more charge. They're shaking, so they might start breaking soon. Right there. there we go. Beautiful. Yeah, so you survived. Now I'll have to have it so that what we'll do is I'll have to have you kind of wait around Alvarega until they assault it and we're able to beat them back. Then we'll have you and my king switch places, basically. Because I really want to be able to send him over to Constantinople. I almost want to have Constantinople be like my capital at some point. And they're not going to attack us again. Good. And then I wonder... I have to figure out, like, what it's going to take to get you guys a piece. I might have to... I, I might try and offer them money. Because, again, I don't really see a reason to fight the whole Roman Empire at this point in time. Um, I could keep pushing into them. Um, just, like, the cities that I'd be pushing into are not a really good defensive line. Right now, I can focus their attacks into castles and or one singular city. Which is not bad for me. It makes it so that I know where they're going to be attacking from. And I can easily prepare for it. If I push further, I also am still trying to talk to Poland still, trying to see if I can get a piece with them. Um, if I push further, like that might reignite uh, the war with Poland where they'll start pushing it back against me right now. Because since I don't border them, they don't care. So like, I just want to get to a point where like, if I'm more passive, maybe we'll be able to get the Holy Roman Empire to leave me alone. Maybe. Uh, you're too old. No. So this is just led by Captain. Um... Art is riding. He's at 60%. Um, let's do this. So, yes. let me guy here. He is at 65. Um, near, it's still 65. You guys over here still yeah, to do get that. Um, and some other guy over. Because, yeah, Arta, there we go. He just needed a second unit. Get some more as well around here. Um, yeah, you can recruit one. Is that actually the limit of one? No. Okay. Yeah, so grab another. Trying to train that guy, and then I can have you go yes. down there next turn. I still need to try that one cab unit at some point. Um, let's see, from commander, level runner, good. Um, ovens. Let's have you get paper mill because I'll give us more trade. Corinthianos again. We want more public order right now, so let's get the better abbey around here. And then we got the assassin over here in Venezia. I'm going to try and grab another one. Grab another one there. And then Who I'll start bringing God? you up this way and keep stabbing. So keep trying to train up over around here. You, um, go try and hide, like, over here, basically. Go hide over there. Um, is there anybody nearby? No. Well, I'll, just, I'll just keep stabbing this army. It's still getting rid, uh, rid of, like, two units per time. Actually, I'm curious. Does it actually reflect that? Because you've got 13, 15, 33. 
whose time is I've never up. checked this for some reason. Oh! We shall not relax, ever! Yes, it does. <laughs> it does reflect, since they do lose one singular dude each time. So, we can slowly whittle their army down until they attack me. Um, you're still making your way up around here. You'll be able to talk to Poland. Uh, actually, they, they might have a city right here, so maybe next turn. And I'll still try and see. Do you guys want to give me yes. these? We do not trust you. So, no. sis, so if that was through. a jest, it's worth a shot to occasionally at least offer it. Um, back over here, we still have to siege that for another five turns until I'm then able to be able to actually move out of the area. Um, you should get the jousting list so you're a little bit happier around there. I do need to get a to serve, watchtower right here. Setting a key and then, watch here. um,. I want to get more free upkeep, and I don't want these guys to just ch chill around here. Yeah, they can move out. I'm going to bring you guys over here so basically I can have some more units be governor garrisons and then use them for my push to the east. Alrighty, let's see. So, uh, that should just be because I'm moving my forces forward. And Civic Leagues have intensified their cooperation. So that means they're just going to hit more trade bonuses now and faster replenishment of their recruitment pools. New era for the Papal States. Interesting. What's going on with that? Um, so siege around here. They're bringing in troops. They might be attacking me soon. Yes. Um, but you know, I'll have you keep making your way over here. Much. And honestly, I might actually use a bunch of these guys to help take rid of out those rebels at some point. Uh, you... 70% still. So. Um, I really need to crown you guys, just because that's going to help with the unrest. I know it will. Squalor is the biggest thing, so actually anything that helps me reduce the population growth is actually going to help around here. So, let's get this. Um, Freeburg is now sieged. Interesting. So, you guys will actually be trying to make your way over here to hit Freeburg. That's fine. It's a, it's a castle, so you'll be good. Uh, they are still sieging me over here. Still captains. Yeah, so just keep stabbing around here, though. So they'll slowly reduce the numbers of men they have around here. Uh, same over... Oh, you pushed my assassin into the city, you assholes. Well, I can do this. Target? I can go up here. Eh? The target, oh, I feel I need. Okay. Let's get another one. Just keep getting more assassins around here. Death stocks of land. Or let's say grab. Uh, that's not what I want. Sure, for more space faction. Um, I'm already building something around here. You're already building something else as well. Uh, I want to get the roads. Yeah, I want to get the roads. Get the roads. I know I need more public order, but I want the roads. Freeburg, your siege right now, so I can't get anything. Um, and then that's just being prepared over there. Um, and then also, one other thing I know... Well, you guys haven't finished anything over there just yet. Alrighty, Captain Wolf. I see you decide to attack Alba Regia. Uh, I wish you a good luck, my good son. So they've got their bounty crossbow as their captain here. Um, as long as I take him out with my army uh, ahead of time, uh, once they get on the ladders, uh, I will absolutely destroy this army. I should be able to easily cause a good chain route and just wreck this force. Then we can have my king make his way. He's going to start getting out of here. And then I'm hoping that he will be able to be crowned. I sh he should be able to. As long as he doesn't have uh, to be ancillaries. I know the castle, the uh, chapel size is large enough in Constantinople. Or, uh, can I, oh God, can I uh, that it should be fine. So let's get you guys off the walls initially. So they have... So I think I'm going to leave these ladders alone. These are the ones I'm going to leave alone. And let's get you guys there, 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 there. Group up guard mode. And then everybody else kind of around up here to turn more towers on. And then actually, and over here too. Um, so what I want to do is have it so you guys I actually think will be over here. Because you might actually be able to shoot into them. It's like right there, right there. You can be up here, and then I'll have the javelins down over here. So you guys will do that. Horse archers will group you guys up. Group you guys up. Guard mode, skirmish mode off. Melee cav, and then skirmish archers. So we're going to leave this one alone. I'll use my melee cav to get out and get them off of all of this stuff. And then I will try and have it so the skirmisher cav will go after their skirmisher cav general. So I'll start the moment. Get you guys running forward. You guys try and run over this way. Kind of right over here. Because you guys are fast enough you might actually be able to also hit them on their siege equipment. Go, 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 go. Okay. Go for the siege tower. Oh, you go for the ram. You go for the siege tower. Uh, yeah, the ladder. 
Well, I can't see, but at least you guys are starting to push on through here. Uh, Missile Cav, you're trying to run past. Nelly Cav, trying to get into with their skirmisher general. Because you guys can get over here. I'll please that. Let me see. Yeah, Nelly General. Oh, he's running. Yeah, push him off the map. Push him off the map. Horse archers. God, I can barely fucking see. Yeah, you guys just keep running around there. Number wise, they've lost 12% of their army. So that's off to a pretty good start. Okay, I can't see, but I think it's time that I start charging in. I know I've ran their captain off of the map now, so we're just going to start trying to charge on in, see if we can start causing some chain routes here. Because I think we should be able to. Yeah, fourth their army's already dead. Oh, yeah, the numbers are climbing. I'm um, taking a little bit more damage than I like, because I just can't see, like, which guys aren't or, uh, are and are not uh, running easily enough because of the snow. But I do know, at this point in time right now, like we've de uh, done a good amount of damage. Okay, half the enemy army is now dead. So we seem to keep trying to slowly run on over here. And keep trying to run them all down. Try and hit over the here. Enemy are Come on, they have you lost guys half their men. Come on, I want big ass chain routes. Let's see, these guys haven't broken yet. I might just pull back for right now. I'm hoping the weather maybe like just clears up a little bit so I can see better. Oh, and as soon as I fucking say that, it does. God damn it, game. Why can't you have listened to me sooner? Now let's just move you guys all together. Yeah, keep charging them. There we go. And now it's a little easier for me to see. Oh yeah, these guys just break immediately. So now I can just like pull back after I get the initial charge. Because it's only when we get the initial charge in and they start running that we want to keep fighting properly. Like right here. Should break. Nope, they're not breaking. So pull back. Number wise, let's see. So 73% are dead so far. Get the Sergeant Spearman. Go. Spearman here next to. People are dead so far. I wish we would have actually killed the general because we only uh, ran him off the map. So it's not nearly as big of a morale penalty as killing him. So it's 88. There we go. Now we just need to figure out who is still fighting. Who's left? Who's not giving up? Oh, it's just this guy. Because once you're dead, that should be the end of the army. Come on. No, it's not you. Somebody else? Oh, some other guys came back. Yeah, there's somebody over here. These spearmen right there. Look and beautiful. Let's just continue just a little bit longer it's just to capture to these guys. Because I don't think I... I don't think any of them ran out with the map, but just in case they did. This is a clear yeah, victory that goes okay. to only not bad. A little more damage than I would have liked. Uh, but hey, that went well. Now we'll be able to have it so I will take my king out of here. I'll be able to send him over to try and get crowned. And I'm really hoping that helps out with the the issues with um, with the unrest. Unrest is disgusting right now. We need to lower it. Now try and ransom. Try to be nice. Try and tell you to fuck off in a kind way. Uh, they are attacking the red. It's a small army. I think you guys will be okay. I could also have my king make his way over there and grab some mercenaries on his way over to help out, but I don't think we have to worry. Farad's got some decent units all already in there. And it's a castle. It's only a one-layered castle, if I remember correctly, but I think we'll be okay. So that way we'll just have it so... We'll just wait until you guys attack me there. Same thing with Freeburg. I think we can just kind of wait on that. I might grab some units, but I don't think we really need to. Actually, no, I could do. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with the, the king bring some mercenaries over there idea. Because I don't want them to recruit the mercenaries. So as long as they don't recruit the mercenaries, then I can just have it. So we'll just have them like sit outside the city and uh, be able to support us. It's been sucked. Now, uh, embezzlement. I know, I'm trying to get more banking houses. I'm trying to do that. Trade routes have been attacked. I will deal with that. Um, you guys are better now. Let's see, I can repair that. Repair that. Repair that. Repair that. Yeah, all that stuff. Repair, repair. So repair all that. And then I'll keep trying to get some more guys around here to help watch over as the garrison. Um, back over here now. So again, I want to move you out. Your will shall be you go orders, here. My lord. So you can watch over the city. And then try and... Let's see, let's try and train these guys. So, try and train those guys. And then I... This was a name general, right? time is up. It is. So all of these assassins try and make their way over here. The target, please. Ooh, That's 73% all chance. Need. Yeah, Who go try and uh, go stab him. You might be able to get to him this time. time. Nah, I can't. Okay. Um, I do have enough movement. There are some mercenaries. There aren't a lot of mercenaries, but let me go, like, back here. We march. Grab that mercenary. Yuck. And if I need to, then I can try and help defend the city. I think you guys are okay. You guys have a decent army in here. Um, they don't have a lot. 
So I'll have you guys just do that. Just one javelin probably should be able to help out a decent amount. Um, that group is still there. That's okay. That's for inspection. Coming of age. Um, I'm just leaving mind it. Let's bring you down. Let's have you go be the governor of Thessalonica. So you can go over there. Building lines. Uh, I don't really have anything else to build around here right now. You guys might attack me. Yeah, you got three you got three turns to try and attack me. Go for it if you're going to. Um, I then want to get this assassin. Who is I my want to try and see if I can stab you. And of course not. Okay, so I'll just have to get another assassin around here. So just keep trying to grab more of those guys. Still waiting them to actually assault that area. I do need to try and train stuff around here. Oh, I really want to try and stab you then. I'm going to grab one. I'm going to grab one. I want to go send it over to Freeburg and I'm going to test it out. Because, like, it looks fucking beautiful. And also, its stats are amazing. I want that so badly. Um, you guys around here, I'm going to have you get the better armor, so that way you guys can try and um, see if that will help out in the defense. And I'll, I'll keep trying to offer them a ceasefire um, whenever I can. Well, I can't right now. Uh, Poland, though. An honor, my lord. Yeah. Oh, I could also try and steal that general. I don't think I'm going to right now, though. Uh, I just want to try and see if we get a ceasefire. Unfortunately, we cannot accept another course of wisdom. Eh. It's yeah, it's not going to go but it was worth a shot. I, I could try again next turn. Uh, I was hoping that maybe they would accept that. They're, it's not that big of an issue. Like, we don't need the peace with Poland, but it would just be nice. Okay, they are going to attack us with Freeburg. <sighs> it feels so weird to be on the other end of this, where in a previous campaign with the Holy Roman Empire, I was endlessly defending this city against Serbia, and now I'm probably going to end up having to endlessly defend it against the Holy Roman Empire. It feels so weird to come full circle. But at this point in time, uh, I've got a decent garrison around here. I do need to see... I see, I don't have... I do have some cap, actually, now, right? Yeah, I have some mercenary cap. So we need to try and get them off of their siege equipment and see if we can take out the general. Because if we can take out the name general, then we should be able to... Oh, is this two layers or one? It is one layer. Yeah, okay. Because when it was uh, one. So... Do they not have ladders? So, siege tower, siege tower, uh, ladders. Okay, so they do have the ladders over here. So, one's probably going to go here, uh, and then one's going to go about here. So, uh, you've got to fight. Okay, so uh, this is the main area I want to defend. So, like, right here. Um, these guys, too, because you guys have armor piercing, I know for sure. And then probably the spearmen on this side, too. So, that's all of you guys. Uh, everybody else is a skirmisher besides you. You can go like right there, I guess. So go like right there. Uh, I will try and have it so. Yeah, some guys can go like right here. Actually, I'm gonna have it be the guy with like you. Or actually, can I put the one with 90 there? Yeah, I can put you guys there. Um, you guys here. That's you guys grouped up. And then other skirmishers over. Some of you up on the walls here. Um, trying to have some of you around here. Javelins will all be down on the ground over here. So I want you guys to be able to throw stuff into this area. Okay, it's not going to work. Right there. There. And there. That's all you guys. Um, so you've been moved. You've been moved. So I need to just you. Okay, so they're there. Melee Cav needs to go right around here. Um, I will just do a bit. So move to you. So all of these guys have been moved. You've been moved. I need to move these. I'm just gonna move you guys here for now, for now generically. And then I'll just try and have it so that you guys. If you're on the walls, have fire will on. If you're down on the uh, off the walls, do not have fire will on. But let's have my calf. We're gonna have to run you guys out. I want to have it so that initially, I go right here, one right here, and then I want to try and get the other ladder that's going to be trying to go over here. I don't want those guys up on the walls. Um, all of you guys down on the ground, you can skirmish mode off for right now. All of you guys turn skirmish mode off, and then I'm just going to adjust you guys myself here. Be able to provide support into this section. There, there. actually, you should be going like back here. Yeah, like right there. You're fine to fire because you're up on the walls. Just so make sure everybody has fire, uh, skirmish mode off, guard mode on. Javelins are all fine. Pull back. Go hit here. You go hit here. And then 
and I just need to make sure that, again, I want them to go here. I do not want them to use the other ramps, other ladders. So right there. Come on. Get drop that. Pull back again. Now we need to go train the other ladder. Go. Pull out of there faster, guys. Boys, one to one so far. Okay, so go, 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 go. I'm a little worried I might not be able to get there in time. Oh, that was close. Okay, never mind. Ignore that. Ignore that. I have to adjust. I have to move all of you guys now to uh, here instead. So all of you guys go here. Because this is the area, the new defense area. Since I hit the wrong set of ladders. Cap, kind of pull back. Let's see, who is the... So he's back here. So we need to still try and kill him. Let's go back here now. Um, that means then I'm going to move some of my skirmishers up here. Because they'll be trying to walk up around this way. So it's actually good to have some... Ooh, actually, I can put the javelins up there. Yeah, so javelins go up there. Right there. There. And there. You guys can then just throw things at them. Okay, because this ladder will get up. Infantry did at least have enough time to adjust, so that's good. So even though we kind of fucked up a little bit there, not using anything else right now. Okay, good. This will allow me to try and focus on the general's bodyguard. He's going to be on this side. Let's hope this charge kills him, because I'd love if we get him on the first charge. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. He's on the left side almost always. Uh, got seven guys in the first charge. Our enemy's ladders have reached come on, come on, come our walls. It is time. He's down to nine future. guys. Eight guys. Oh, he's almost dead. Almost there. Just don't bring the infantry in yet. They're bringing everybody else now. I don't even need to reset them. So, you guys are making your way up. Um, don't my skirmishers get over here. I don't think some of them did. Uh, I am going to have to adjust to you guys, though. So, some of you can go over here. Slow it down a little bit. Right there. Right there. Right there. Um, right Our out. Men have slain there. The enemy general. Now, Without are you guys going to be breaking from that or not? At the moment, no. Javelins? You're throwing things. It's not where I want you to. Also, some of you guys didn't fully get into position. No, it's really not. So you guys go there. Yep, some of you are still stuck over here. Uh, I don't exactly what I want. They are wavering, though. So let's try and get my cav. Try and get you over here. See if I can maybe cause a chain route from shooting them. Um, you... Don't have the best angle, so I don't want to try and shoot over here just yet. Basically, we'll just get the javelins in. Leave them on fire at will, and everybody else has to wait until there's an actual visible spot to shoot into. Yeah, and some of them are already starting to break now. So my cab is almost in position. Try and get over here. Try and charge like right about here. So if you guys can go do that, we might cause a chain route. Because I've already lost, eh, I've lost 30% of my guys so far. Uh, come on, come on, come on. And my guys are breaking. Okay. We're just gonna have to fight this the good old fashioned way. And, uh, hope we're good enough. I do have a good uh, line of sight here now, so I actually will tell you guys to start firing. Um, well, you actually need to adjust. I'm actually... The battle is very much um, in our favor. You go to the we safe center. And Victory will be ours. I'm gonna get you guys up here, actually. So if you guys go there. Javelins the aren't actually properly in position. So you guys Give go there. And halt this turn uh, I guess you move some of the other crossbow, other skirmishers over here. So if you guys make your way over here, then we can try and have it so that um, you guys can keep trying to fire in here. So far, it seems like we're okay. Some of them are breaking. Even some of the foot knights are breaking. That's what we really want to see. Honestly, I'm, trying to, I'm tempted. Will you guys let me just, like, slowly move my skirmishers out of the city and not even, like, try and rush people in and just let me shoot those guys? Like, it'd be great, because at the moment right now, they're just a massive-ass blob. I don't have any cav to try and run into it. I've taken out 20% of their army so far. I'm at 24% of my own, which is not the best. So I think I am going to try and see. They might literally be just focusing so hard over there, they might not notice this. 
This is going to also just make me lose the battle right now, but we'll have to see. Um, so yeah, you guys go here. They're not paying attention. I'm not, they're not paying attention at all. So yeah, we'll, we'll get these guys out. I'm going to have you guys basically just yeah, run out, move around. Um, that unit's broken. Yep. Oh, yeah, our guy's broken there. So if we like stand like right here, we should be able to shoot into them and honestly also capture some of them. Um, you came back, there's only two of you though, so I don't expect to be able to do much with you. But yeah, let's like get you guys, so crossbows, so kind of like right there, and then these guys, kind of like right there, seems almost certain. essentially, and then I'll just tell you to run on forward, oh, they, they're coming back, so hold off on fully running there, like go like right there, like go like right there, start shooting what you can, and then once they start breaking again, that's when we want to move forward. Okay, okay, okay. Just don't advance over with your cap. Um, yeah, like right here. Push forward. 22, 24. I do need to make sure that you guys... Okay, you can't shoot over there just right now, that's okay. Um, so for now, though, you guys should be able to. So yeah, I kind of go like right here. And then these guys... Kind of like that. Yeah, like right there. Perfect. Oh, that's... Didn't need to start fighting you guys in melee. Back up, back up, back up. You guys got a little too close. You got a little too eager. Get back up. Uh, I should return up skirmish guard mode off for right now. So you guys just back off. They are breaking. But I don't get to run into them with this right now. So you just kind of back off, guys. You guys should be good. So, yeah, you guys get set up here. And then hopefully... Ah, uh, yeah, the crossbows need to just keep running. Yeah, you guys just start firing. It's 26 to 30. Yeah, these guys are just following me, and I do not want that. What's so fucking ever? Please turn around. Please turn around. Please go back towards the ladders. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so let's get you guys set up again. And just keep firing. There we go. So, I was able to take out about half their army, and at this point in time now, they've been able to get on the walls. I'm still hitting them with my javelins and my archers here. We are able to survive. Hopefully I recover a decent chunk of my army, because losing 40% is pretty bad around here. Although, most of these are mercenaries, so that's not that bad. Uh, I can't retrain mercenaries anyways. I need to get some proper troops around here that I can retrain. So, getting some our swordsmen or some um, spearmen around here would be really great. Uh, about 6%. Exactly. That's not bad. I did lose those mercenary spearmen. The mercenary mason looked like they died too. That's not that bad. First defense of Benny, Oran Freeberg. <laughs> I wonder if we're going to give this city uh, a similar name like we did, like with. Because uh, we made it Wealthburg in the Holy Roman Empire campaign. That's because we had Wealth Wealth defending it. Um, I don't think we're going to find anybody similar to that in this campaign, sadly. Because that was just too mean not to name the city after him, especially since his entire family line was built up around defending that city. Okay, you're de attacking Alba Regio once again as well. That shouldn't be too much of an issue. I was able to retrain a little bit around there. And I have a general still in that city. So as long as he survives, we should be okay. Let's see, enemy camp sacked. Okay, let's go first over to Freeburg first. Trigger are attacked again. Um, so over here. Let's see, so first, I can't retrain anybody, but I can try and recruit some units around here. So grab that. Let's also now try and get the landowner's guards. Built that up so we can actually train some more guys. And then my diplomat. Um, let's try and see if we can maybe go. I want to get. I want to try and see if you'll give me a ceasefire at some point. So let's try and go over here. And then, uh, assassin. <laughs> let's keep stabbing. Oh. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna be a dick. Orders, my king. Yeah. Marching Fuck to you. Pride, Lord. Oh, I don't want to exterminate it. Now we sack it. Victors. Sack the city, Strike and then I'm just gonna fuck off. Yes. Uh, I'm gonna burn everything in here, though, first.
And then technically, since I'd win in there for one turn, I might also spread the plague to it. Um, I also just jacked up the taxes, so we're good. So yeah, now we might have uh, spread plague there. I'm siege around again. I'll be right. I think we should be okay. My spies died. It's okay. Um, they're happier with the conquest. Oh no, is that you guys? I don't care. I'm not gonna control that city. I don't want it. Um, let's see, you guys. Let's get the armor. Arta, I want to get the. Yeah, let's get the House of Crates. Then, Salonica. Um, again, I'm going to try. Let's increase my population growth. <laughs> Damn it, that's fine. Um, and that's just all being repaired there. Okay. Yes, you, Paul. still, keep making me over here. Watch yes. over the city. And then it's uh, two turns until you guys finally give up around here. Um,. Let's see, I don't think there's anything else I want to do around there. I just can't build anything. Um, they actually stopped attacking for rad. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, let me train everybody. And I'll try and get like one more archer, just in case. Uh, and then I'll leave these javelins here. So I'll leave these javelins. And then I will continue making my way down. So go here. Give me a watchtower. And I will be to Constantinople next turn. So I want to make sure that next turn I have enough money. I need to make sure I have 20,000 at the end of my turn to be able to crown myself. Uh, Quintanos, definitely get these guys because I know they'll be free upkeep. You're at 70% right now, but still, grab a little bit more. Um, over here, yeah, same deal. I do want to get these guys. I do want to grab these guys. I think I'll do that next turn, maybe. Um, for the meantime, though... Each works. Napoli, you guys should get this. Regium, uh, get the jousting lists. Um, Zara, I can't really build anything right now. Well, I can get the church. Um, and then this I can repair because there's a net positive. That I'm going to hold off on for right now. And I think that's it for you guys. I get to finally test out this unit. What's in this army? I don't think I can win this, but I'm going to try it. We are going to try our best. I think this is technically the exact same unit that they actually have as like some other heavy cab, but still, I can, I'll can. i probably be able to do a lot of damage here. This unit's already full of plague, so uh, wherever I send them is going to be an issue. But hey, let's at least try and fight, because now I get to showcase this unit. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Okay, start the battle. And then let's see, so... Hunters... Javelin, the Javelin first. Hit the Javelman first, and we'll see how much damage we can do, because you guys have a really good charge. I think you didn't have a better charge than my general's bodyguard, I think? Yeah, I'll just look at this. And hit the Sergeant Man at Arms first, but you, oh my god, almost destroyed the entire unit. Did 100 kills in that charge. Yeah, try and get out of there. Try and pull back. Yeah, 20% of their army died of that. Scouts I can easily beat if I can get in melee with them first. So pull back, pull back, pull back. Yeah, I'll just try and charge them. Because stat-wise, I should absolutely demolish these scouts. Come on. Oh, they took some damage. My lord, only half of our Not as much as I would have liked there. Yeah. Yeah, the male knights can now beat me. Yeah, and ran. That's okay. Still do a good amount of damage. Uh, we'll pull those guys back. We'll try and get them retrained now after this so that you guys can uh, eventually be able to use those units again because that was, that was good. That was good. That was, that was a lot of damage. So even if we lost that fight, that's fine. It was one dude. If I had multiple of those, oh, I would have destroyed those. I will accept that, actually. Don't put me into the city. I don't want this fucking city. I wanted to rebel. I want, like, Hungary to come back or something. Um, or to go to somebody else, maybe. Not, mm, not to Poland, because I am, I don't want to be at war with Poland. I'll try, I still need to try and talk to Poland again this next turn. Actually, I didn't really border them with this city. So, um... Mm, let's see, camp sacked, that's fine. Uh, Explorers Guild, no, I don't want anything around here. No more Marshall on Freeburg. Let's see, funds. We don't care about that. I'm trying to have the city rebel. So you try and come back down around this way. So you do that. And then... Let me get a little bit more over here before I was sieged. That's something at least. Um, what I can do at least, though, is... You guys. Let's get some horse archers around here. Because uh, I can have you guys get in range of Freeburg. 
And so I can at least have you guys try and support that. Family tragedy, the noble lady. No. And now. Honor. Have you come for the Kaiser's forgiveness? Nine. Only a dumb cop. <sighs> this was hardly guys, I don't time. need to fight you. I'm just going to keep kicking your ass. Um, let's see. I think I should be able to. Yes, I can. So now, I need to make sure I don't spend yes. any money. and uh, Or is not that much money, at least. And I should be crowned next turn. Because I've got max authority. I just need at least six and six. And then you'll be good. So then, we can build a little bit. But it's not too much. Um... Let's get let's get something that's cheap. You guys are happy enough I can get the grain exchange. Um then that's just been repaired. God, they're so pissed off. Well at least I'll soon be able to get a free upkeep unit around there. Mm. Look how those guys are doing around there. Okay. For right now though, uh that should be good. I just want to not spend any money, and I just want to make sure they were crowned. And I think for now at least. Well, no, I should it's a captain. Who is captain, but still go stab. Oh! Go stab, and then where'd my other assassin go? Yes. So, Sire. spy, 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 assassin. Whose time? Who is my time? Whose oh, did he die? Oh, I think he died. Who is my Whose time is up? Okay, I can at least have you. Yeah, try and get rid of this guy. That's all I need. And then is my? Yeah. If he's in the city, Who so I can't actually target? try and stab anything. Uh, not what I wanted, but that's okay. And here they come once again. So this army here, captain is the mailed knight this time. So that'll be a little bit more difficult to actually kill him. But still, same kind of deal. We want to basically just have it so we'll get the ram and siege towers and everything down. Get them onto just the ladders. And then, after that, we will try and see, while we're doing that, take out their uh, general. So we'll have my horse archers be the one doing that. They will be trying to kill the mailed knights. And then once he's dead, hopefully we can have it so that we'll be able to just break the rest of the army. That's my hope. So, stretch moment. Uh, get you guys off the walls. How many ladders? So we've got one ladder here. Uh, this ladder I want to let up, though, because that's only got two guys. So we'll put all of my men over here. So there, there. And then you, you, and these guys as well. you be around here. And then I'll put my archers over here. That way you guys can maybe... Uh, no, nah, go over here. Go over here. And then same with uh, you guys. Crap, crossbows. That way you can just unload them to them. Javelins just chill here. And then we just want to have it so horse archers. And then my melee cav at the gates here. So it's right around here. Start the battle. Horse archers just try and run straight over this way. Uh, melee cav, get them off of this stuff first. We'll ignore this. You guys want to save your ammo, so cease fire, but still. Run over this way. Go. Run, run, run. Get them off of that ladder. Get them off the ram. And then pull back. Get them off of the siege tower. It's the mounted crossbowmen we don't care about. Okay, siege tower is dropped. Pull back. You guys. Let's keep trying to get around to the back side. Only our those guys. Ladders have reached our walls. Uh, I'll have you try and fight these butcher. guys in a second. Oh, I don't know why you guys aren't. Okay, let's go around here. Oh, let's try to avoid those guys. Okay, go into melee with these guys. You all. Yeah, trying to loop around. Captain is right here. So he's the one we're going to want to try and focus on. Melee cap, again, focus on the mounted crossbows. I should have you guys getting melee there too. This guy's already wavering, so he should die any second now. Yeah, especially if you're running in there. Beautiful. Now, let's get my horse archers over here. On the walls right now, at least. Since the only have two ladders, there'll be a lot less of them going up onto the walls. So I might not have to worry about them at all. So horse archers. Again, focus on the male knights. And then we'll just start getting prepared. Oh, um, let's see. You guys got pull back. Yeah, there we go. Hey, you can skirmish. There you go. Keep him, to, keep him in range. Keep him in range. Melee Cav, just ignore him. Because if he can just shoot him to death, that's all we need to do. There you go. By the grace of God, okay. Our men have now, let's just bring you on up. I'll have you use the rest of your ammo on these guys, and then I'll start trying to charge into them. Melee Cav over here. At least get ready to start trying to run them down. Because at least so far right now, you guys are just throwing your, your lives away up here. And you guys are slowly dying. Horse archers. Let's see, you guys almost here yet? 
Oh, no, you are. Yeah, you're, you're in range. Uh, get a little bit closer so you're just not missing as much. So yeah, right there. Just shoot point-blank range into these guys. They just have their backs to us. So it's pretty easy to keep just unloading into them. As soon as you're out of ammo, that's when we charge. I'm hoping that will break them all. Swing on you. you got a little bit more ammo. Right about there. Okay. Now let's charge into this spot. So try... Oh, come on, guys. I know you can do this. Okay, just do this. It's the best I can do to try and get you guys to charge. <laughs> yeah, run them all down. Just, just run them all down. There you go. Yeah, make sure none of these guys get away. Beautiful. Perfect. How long do you guys think it's going to take to try and convince them to give me a piece? Because I keep kicking their ass here. Like, that's all three, four hundred guys captured, all, 50 casualties. We have won here today. Oh, I need to see more fights like this. So as long as I can keep retraining my cav, uh, I can do a lot of damage around here. Because we're just going to be focusing on pushing to the east. Like, that's all we want to do is we just want to go to the east. I want to fight the Fatimids. I want to fight the Byzantines. And that will get us to where we need to go for our victory conditions. Because I haven't taken these cities today. We're just we've been defending. Well, technically I took line, but I'm not going to control that. Because we just need, we need 17 regions. Um, yeah, 17 regions to win the campaign. Uh, I think, I know of at least five territories that the Byzantines have. So that's five. We need then 12 more. One of which is going to be from, oh, hi guys. You don't have your friends, do you? No, you don't. Yeah, I'm, I'm good with that. One casualty, I'm good. And then just, um... They must fear us now. We're going to be sitting here a bit anyway. So I think we can get away with just occupying it. Because I want to try and have it so we're not being so aggressive and other factions are going to be pissed off at us. So we'll just occupy this territory from these guys. Oh, also the income around Shinna's grab grad went up by like 2 to 3k. Hell yeah. The, I can't wait until I have all of Anatolia. I can't wait to see how much money that hat makes. Honestly, I, I know I need to do a campaign in Stainless Steel at some point with me playing as the Byzantines. Probably reforming the Roman Empire. I've done that every single fucking time. <laughs> but that'll be a while out. But, like, I've always loved them in Stainless Steel. They're they're so fun to play in Stainless Steel. And the amount of money that I can make in that in Constantinople itself. Like, I generally did the... There was the one city challenge I did as a subscriber milestone uh, celebration video. Which is fun. I, I, I need to, like, maybe either go back to that. Or I need to have it so that I, I do a proper full campaign playing as the Byzantines in Stainless Steel. Now, was I crowned? I uh, know. I want that area to fucking rebel. Yes. It still hasn't and rebelled, watch. even though I want it to rebel. Um, oh, actually. How about this? Your Majesty. Shall Ceasefire. Out, now give you much. that city. Not that. Not not my fucking. Not no. Um, how about that? Now don't fight me. But that did make it. So now I have. I don't have to worry about this area. You guys are at war with the Holy Roman Empire, if I remember correctly, right? You are. So I just strengthened you guys and made it harder for the Holy Roman Empire to attack me. Um, around here, yeah, just keep retraining you guys. This we keep doing that continuously. I will have you Hold send these guys team. over. Yes. Get them in range of the castle. And try and provide some support. Um, Mongols are with you guys now. Interesting. Um, At your I almost wonder. We Ooh, actually. You, so this had best be good. If that was a jest, I don't mind the idea of me trying to just take a random ass city like over here because they're probably not going to be able to hold it and using that as a way to uh, get a ceasefire with the Holy Roman Empire. Because I know I want this territory. Um, so if I get a, give them a city down there, they're more likely to not be able to keep it. Um, okay, before we look at that first. Crowned! Hell yeah! So he is now crowned. He is now the Emperor of Serbia. Oh, I love that. So now we have the crown. Yeah, crown of the Serbs, plus two authority, plus one law, plus one popularity, plus one line of sight. So that now should have it. So that all the unrest in my cities should be reduced. 
Uh, you guys are pissed off. Just lower the taxes and you'll be okay. I know because I occupied it as opposed to sack it, it's a little bit more unhappy. That's okay. I am trying to be nice. We don't have to worry about conversion, so I'm just going to get this immediately to make you guys happy. So grab that and then just those lands. And then you. Better farms. Yeah, better farms there. Um, get the better house. The house is Thetagos. You. Siege works, I guess. You. Oh, those mines. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I want those mines. And then you guys. Um, probably the. Yeah, get the water mills. Get the water mills there. Also, get some more guys to watch over the city and help out with that. But then, I think for the most part, I do need to... I'm going to now start grabbing these. So, let me grab... Um, let's do about two-ish turns of recruitment. I'll use those guys to destroy you. And then I'll probably just pick those guys up. And I'll maybe just send them over to help out. Also, get rid of these guys. Because um, I just want to use them quick and easy. And if anything, they just take as much damage as they can. And then I'll basically just throw them into the front lines over here, basically. Because uh, I do need to try and keep doing more damage against the Byzantines. But we can slowly take a time with that. Uh, let's probably do maybe one more turn end, I think. Uh, and then see where we're going to be leaving off. I might have to do the Battle of Freeburg. Alrighty, let's see. So they started sieging me uh, over here now. Uh, ooh, you're not bad. Ugly school, married to the family, normal intelligence, fit for office. I'm going to take you because I need more governors. Um, Hail the king. Your faction has been crowned and now he rules with greater legitimacy. The coronation ceremony was magnificent with nobility, ambassadors, priests, and common folk coming from every corner of your kingdom. All were impressed um, after this first of the event. Do your factions and give a from now on. Generals far from the capital will be able to retain their loyalty. Um, and see, and for more, all of the unrest and all of the settlements will be decreased significantly in addition to this. You can receive other advantages as well. However, these benefits don't come with certain costs. Yeah, so we now have to pay a maintenance cost now, basically. Which is kind of sad, but that's fine. Um, so now, I'm going to have you uh, go to Arta for now. So you can go down there. Making oh yeah, no, so they're siege me over here. Which... Uh, I should be fine. Yeah, I should be fine over there. So they're still siege me, but I, I do like the idea... Also, had somebody come of age. Um, I was over here. Ooh. Yes, Lord. Yes. Are they happy enough to leave? And have yes, you watched them? Orders, my Lord. No. Not right now. Well, maybe. My Lord. Yes. Forward. Move out. Sixty. They go down to daily races. You would be happy then. I can get these guys as free upkeep. So that way I can have you guys, um, let's keep making my way over, and I will have you start making your way over to this city. So we will start sieging you, start trying to take that settlement next, and for the most part now, yeah, just kind of slowly build these guys up. I need to keep eating more public order if I can around here to make you guys a little bit happier. Um, but I think for the most part right now, I'm probably going to have us be done for today. Um, we've been able to do a good amount of defenses against the Holy Roman Empire. Um, I now have it so that I've been crowned. That should reduce the unrest in most of my territories. Looks like it's going down, I think. Um, but no, uh, I do wonder, and I know I mean to try and pose this question earlier. Um, this campaign is getting close to finishing. I am curious, what mods do you guys think I should try after this one? Um, I know really kind of tempted to do the uh, Europa Barborum 2 again. It's been a while since I played that mod, and it's been updated recently from what I've been told. Um, also, I've been tempted to maybe go back to the uh, Imperial Roma... Uh, or, oh my god. <sighs> Roma Serectum for Rome Remastered. Uh, I'm curious what you guys think. If you guys have any suggestions, like, feel free to let me know down in the comments. Otherwise, I was thinking about trying to just do a poll. Uh, well, I'm going to do a poll, obviously, at some point, but I'm just like, uh, just a community tab post to try and see hey what do what do people think we should do because i know we want to start trying to think about that now since we only need 16 regions in this mod that's going to still take a while but still it's probably a good idea to start thinking about that now or we'll sooner rather than later but i think i'll be done for today so hopefully you guys enjoyed this if you guys did let me know down in the comments down below i love hearing you guys have to say about this and anything else you have to say about this campaign but this is rampant i'll see you guys next time